What is up? It is Wednesday, my dudes. It's Miles back here with another video. This one is super, super important, guys. If you run an agency, a consulting company, um, really just any company that is going to be running or accessing other companies' accounts on Facebook to run ads, to edit or add content on their pages, this is a must-know. And I don't see any other... Um, bigger YouTubers or really just anybody running agencies talking about how to do this. And this is super important. It's something that I don't, it's it skipped over. I don't understand why. So I'm going to show you guys how to use the Facebook business manager today, um, how to access the pages and ad accounts that you need to, that you need to be able to access and post ads and content on other companies' profiles. So guys, Here's what we're going to do. Um, you're going to, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to business.facebook.com. It's going to take you here. You're going to see this right here. You're just going to go to create account. Okay. Now it's trying to log me into my regular profile and I made an account just for this. So I can show you guys kind of from step one, uh, where you guys are going to be. So what was the account name? Bill Johnson, Facebook at Gmail. Okay, and I think that's the password. So just go ahead and log into your regular profile that you're going to be using on Facebook. Just hit log in. Okay, and you're going to see your personal ad account. You're going to have that no matter what. So you can post ads from your personal account, but what we're trying to do is make a business manager account so that we can take on clients and organize them in one place. So we're just going to hit create account. So name your business. So marketing company. Alrighty, but put your real business name in there, your agency name, okay? And your name and your email address. So Bill Johnson at Bill Johnson Facebook at gmail.com. You hit finish and that should be it. It should take you to this page right here and you have your business manager account set up. Now, from here, you will see you can create and claim pages and you can create and claim ad accounts. Those are the two things that you need to be able to access and post ads and content on other companies' profiles uh, or pages, my bad. So guys, what we're gonna do here, the first thing we're gonna go to hit this, we're gonna hit this business settings button right here up in the top right. It's gonna take you to a new tab and this is the settings for the business manager. This is an important place where you're gonna manage the pages and the ad accounts and who has access and what type of access they have. So the people tab right here you see is you're gonna see yourself obviously and you're, once you, if you hire on reps that are also gonna be posting ads or accessing uh, pages, you're gonna, you can add in people and they're gonna be listed right here as well. But obviously since it's just us right now, it's just us and it will show here the pages, the ad accounts and the product catalogs that you have access to. So we're going to go ahead and move on to the pages um, row right here in this column. And it says that you don't have any pages yet. So what you're going to want to do is um, right here, you, get, you can click this setup guide and you can claim, claim ad accounts and you can claim pages. So uh, if, so here, what we're going to do is, since we this is a new account and we don't have any page set up for our agency, we're going to make a um, company, we're going to make a page right now. So we did marketing company. So again, this is going to be whatever your company name is, whatever your agency name is, you're going to put that in here. I'm assuming you probably already have a page for your agency, but if you don't, you can create one right here. We're going to pick consulting agency and create page. So we created the page and now we're going to create the ad account. So it'll take us back here, guys, to the pages. So this is our company. This is our, our agency uh, page. So then we're going to do what we're going to do is we're going to create the ad account. So go back, click that button for the setup guide and hit create ad account. Now, you guys, you don't have to do this, these steps if you already have an ad account and a page for your agency. But I'm just doing this from bare bones from the start. So marketing company. If I could spell. So on the behalf of marketing company, this is the ad account and you can set up payment methods later. I can show you guys how to do that. It's pretty simple, but for the sake of this tutorial, we're just going to be doing um, the ad accounts and the pages, create the ad account there and boom. 
you click your name because you're gonna have you're gonna have access to the ad account go ahead and select admin save changes okay boom so now this is your companies so this is your agencies ad account and page right here so guys if this is where you're at now you have your company's page and ad account set up now what you're gonna have to do is if you take on a client you're gonna have to get access to their page and their ad account so what you're gonna do is from here you're gonna hit the add new pages um, button right here and you're gonna hit request access to a page now this is where you are going to um, you're well first you're gonna choose that you want access through the marketing company um, account you hit next so your agency you hit next and then it's gonna take you to this and this is gonna this is where you're gonna put in the URL or the Facebook page name to whatever company you're gonna be working for so let's say it's a dentist you know you type in the dentist URL or the dentist name and then you hit request access right here and that is going to send a request to them that they can then go on to their page and accept you as um, um, an admin or an advertiser or whatever for their Facebook page you're gonna do the same thing for ad account now guys there's two parts like I said there's two parts you have to have access to to create ads you have to have access to the page and you have to have access to the ad account okay so once you have access to the page you're gonna click the ad account and you're gonna do the same thing here you're gonna hit this button right here you're gonna have um, the same options here but you're gonna to want to request access to an ad account and what's gonna happen here is you're going to again if the company you're working for doesn't have an ad account set up which this would be if they've never ran Facebook ads before they're not gonna they're most likely not gonna have an ad account set up so you're gonna want them to set it up or you can set it up for them like this it's the same process we're doing right here you're just gonna create the ad account super simple but if they already have an ad account set up you're gonna have to get the ID number from them and that ID number is um, right here the account number so this is this is mine for this fake company I made up but they're gonna give you that account ID number and you're gonna go ahead and type that in here and you're gonna hit confirm it's gonna send a request over to them just like it did for pages they're gonna accept it and you're gonna have access to both their page and their ad account and with that you can then now start posting ads on through their through their page guys so that is it it is super simple once you guys get into the system and you actually understand what these things are. So again, guys, if you have to watch this video again, I know that it can be a little bit confusing. Facebook, um, you know, it makes it a little bit difficult to um, understand what you're doing and what these things actually mean. So just to um, just to reiterate, guys, you're gonna want to create your business page and ad account for your agency. So if you haven't done that already, I just kind of did a step-by-step -step on how to do that. You go through, you create the page, you create the ad account. Then from there, you get access to the companies that you're working for. You add in, you request the ID for their page and for their ad account here. And that's it, guys. Once you have access to those, you can then post ads. You can go in and create content, edit content. Um, you really, depending on what access they give you. So, um, you know, you'll see other company names here and you'll see what access you have right here as a role. So you can be an analyst or an advertiser, a moderator, an editor, or an admin. So um, that is up that is up to the company you're working for, what kind of access they want to give you. And that's obviously something you can discuss with them. But that is it, guys. If you have any questions, which I'm sure you probably will, go ahead and leave them down below. I will get back to you as soon as I can. And if you like the video, if this helped you, please throw the video a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already, guys. And that is it. I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.